There's only three days left to buy your tickets for lightcastbootcamp.com. I'm not doing this series again, folks. Come on down, at least take a look at the video, see what we're doing. This is a special opportunity to come into your light, to come into your power, and take control of your reality. That's at lightcastbootcamp.com. Hello, Your Honor, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, good news, sunny and cool today for the judge and juries of the Zodiac. And on the fulcrum day, you guys know what fulcrums are, big part of being a scale. Moon is in your sign, putting emotions into ego consciousness. So ego and emotions are both charged. Your emotions are electrically charging your ego. Now, your ego is what's under design with Saturn and Libra. If you're just joining us in Soul Garden, welcome. The Librans, which are the natural born artists on the planet, are working on changing their ego. Basically, Librans have gotten to a point where too much was on your scales. And scales meaning trying to handle too much, trying to balance too much. A lot of it comes down to that decision making, so to speak, right? And what you're trying to do now is start to keep things in balance. In most cases for Librans, more fair. But I know some Libran guys, for instance, that never let women in their heart or are very unfair. So, you know, just when you have a talent, you have just as much ease to abuse it. So today, you might be a little emotionally thrown off for a second or two. That's you just learning the latest lesson of staying balanced, especially as emotions charge your field. But let's look at that sun. This month, we're in chapter two of Sun and Leo. Librans are finding their royal place in the world. In fact, that's the way Librans are. Librans treat the world like royalty, and Librans expect to be treated by, like royalty from the world, very much like that judge image that you guys all go to, even artists, Libra artists. Uh, but today, it is time to kind of feel out with your emotions and ego, you know, whether or not your place in the world is serving your heart, okay? Your love for the job, for the person, for anything, your love is worth throwing on the scales. Hey, I love this. We've got to make it work. But if you don't love something, okay, why are you keeping it on the scales? You don't have to do anything you don't love. In fact, remember, our soul contract with God universe is what we love. That's our soul contract. Anything else is something you've added since you arrived. And Mars, the planet of aggression, masculinity, getting to work, is in Cancer, telling Librans, time to get to work. Last month, Librans did a lot of digesting on where career control will go and control issues within themselves, etc., etc. Whatever you learned, go forward, says Mars, and maketh happeneth, and do it now. So you're going to feel a little impatient, maybe, about career stuff, but that impatience is actually the energy of Mars saying, go, go, go. And Skip Jennings, our urban mystic, is live today. Now, he's a cancer, so if you need a little cancer, self-nurturing, kind of what your career is supposed to be, Skip is a walking embodiment of that. But Skip's live today, helping you dive into love consciousness and exploring and swimming in this love consciousness, trying to root out what's not working and where we want to aim. He's going to give you a seven-day challenge and some great advice. He's live today everywhere the garden is shining. Well, Your Honor, that wraps up Wednesday, but I'll see you tomorrow with more Live Love Be. So...